My name is Aaron Chandler and you're watching Coast Chai YouTube channel. The perfect place for theme park news, reviews and vlogs. After all, I've always got roller coasters running through my mind. <laughs> All you beautiful thrill seekers, my name is Coach Shadong Stabon, Boat Boat Theme Parks, and welcome to a theme park news update where today it's video number three and the finale of today's uploads. Now, this is from Kentucky Kingdom, and this is talking about the Raptor Project. Now, I've had comments left, right, center, uppercutted at me for months about what's happening, what's happening, where's it going, where's it going, is it opening, is it opening, is it cancelled, is it cancelled? Please stop. I have got the answer right here, right now. I've had it for the last couple of weeks and I wanted to deliver it in a video. It's been hard sharing my thoughts about this because I was unsure which direction to go in with my updates and my opinions on this topic. But I do have all the details. So before we get started, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss another thrilling YouTube video. Also, guys, if you go into the description of this video, not only will you find a Coaster Nation article where all the information came from in this video, but also you can submit your video ideas using the Google Forms link. You can also go ahead and subscribe to Twitter, uh, TikTok, Snapchat, and Instagram. And also, guys, follow the Discord server where you can join thousands and thousands and thousands of other Coaster Shell fans for free and chat with me and the rest of the fans online for all eternity and for now guys go and check out the previous videos from alabama adventure and the alton towers resort from today and let's get into this about kentucky kingdom's raptor and exactly what is happening but by the title of the video you have an idea about what's happening so according to the Coaster Nation article, if you scroll down yourselves after this video, if you find the article in the description down below, you'll see where it says update and it is the 8th of the 12th, 2020. Yes, it's a long time since this, this update came out, but I wanted to collect my thoughts on it properly. So with the current pandemic, many parks are altering future plans to deal with the financial aftermath of COVID-19. In other words, the dreaded C word. Um, it seems that the RMC Raptor project by Kentucky Kingdom has been terminated and is not moving forward. All documents submitted to the FAA for the coaster have been removed, a move seen with other cancelled projects, such as the cancelled hypercoaster from B&M for California's Great America. It's curious, though, that for the FFA documents to be filed, parks would have to be financially invested in an upcoming project. It's unknown what happened to the project or whom it may have been sold to if it was started. Now, of course, this is an interesting topic. However, I reckon the story of this particular investment is not yet over. We haven't reached the final chapter just yet, and I reckon we could be a long way from finding that final chapter. So there we go. So a move that's been done by many other theme parks, um, like California's Great America with the Hypercoaster, the project is terminated. And I don't mean Arnold Schwarzenegger as the Terminator. It's not... I'll be back. It's I won't be back or I could be back at a different place. Now, um, it is interesting the fact that they submitted these FFA documents and the fact that the files submitted to the FAA, got you wrong there. It's interesting that the files submitted, I mean, it's unknown whether this has been sold to someone else and where it's been sold to. The fact it's been terminated from Kingdom Kingdom suggests it and from the looks of it, it's from the curiousness of the article, maybe it will go somewhere else. Now, whether a new park's going to open this project, we do not know. However, I think if a new park is buying the Kingdom Raptor project, I reckon we're looking at a 2022 date here, or a 2023 for the new park to release it. Now, obviously, the, t the documents removed suggest it has been terminated. However, many of the people across forums and other videos have speculated in the past couple of weeks that maybe it's not a complete termination, but just a shelving of the plans. They've removed the projects from the FFA docu FAA documents, not FFA, FAA documents, and maybe they're going to revisit them in a couple of years once the financial impact of COVID is done and out the way and back to normal. And it should be interesting to see. That's why I was saying at the end of that report there, that the chapter of this story has not yet reached the final one. It's not really reached the final chapter. We're sort of in the anticlimax bit here, like, Ooh, what's going to happen? I'm on the edge of my seat. It's like watching a Harry 
Potter film or reading a Beatrix Potter novel. Um, so it, we haven't reached the final chapter of this story yet because we still don't know. We, we, there's still unraised questions that we have to ask. You know, where's it gone to? You know, what's going to happen next for Kentucky Kingdom? And I'm guessing that I mean, they're going to be questions that we'll answer in time. And it's going to be interesting to see what kind of answer we get from these particular questions. I would stay tuned to Ghost Child and other news sources to find out exactly what's going on with Kentucky Kingdom with this project. And also stay tuned to other parks to see if they're planning to open some kind of coaster in the near future. But for now, guys, thank you very, very much for watching this small update on Kentucky Kingdom. Again, make sure you go stay tuned to the videos over the next few days. We've got a lot of content coming, including, including the new year trailer for 2021. We're releasing the trailer on January. January the 1st, 2021, to reveal the brand new year for Coaster Chow. 2020 has been brilliant. I will do a full roundup um, on New Year's Eve, probably. I'll, really, I'll film that video on New Year's Eve. It will be a long one, so I'm going to have to charge this up uh, before I film it. But for now, guys, thank you very, very much for watching this video. Make sure you go and watch the other videos from today from Alabama Adventure at the Al and the Alton Towers Resort. Not at the Alton Towers. Alabama Alton. I never heard such a thing in my life. Uh, Alabama Adventure and the Alton Towers Resort. Two brilliant videos. One about past events at Alton Towers that I'd like to bring back. And another one about the brand new Rocket Racer announcement at Alabama Adventure for next year. So make sure you go but you watch both them videos. Make sure you go and watch all the other videos we've uploaded. There's plenty more videos coming, like I said. Uh, loads of news updates. Loads of discussion videos as well. I love doing the Alton Towers one today and previous discussion videos so it'd be great to do more of them for loads of different parks around the world so please stay tuned for more of that and for now guys my name is coast shall keep living the coast life and i'll see you guys in the next video very very soon take care guys have a kentucky tastic day oh i love that name